so we need to solve this given system of equation using substitution method so what is substitution method in substitution method we take the value of either x or y from one equation and put that into other equation to get the values so let's suppose this is our equation number 1 and this is equation number 2 so from equation 1 i can say that my x is 14 minus y if you leave x this side take y to the rhs then you will get x equals to 14 minus y now put this value of x in equation number 2 we take either value of x or y from one equation and put that in other equation so if you put this in equation number 2 you will get x in place of x put 14 minus y minus this y equals to 4 now this becomes equation of one variable which we can easily solve so 14 minus 4 equals to 2y Tan equals to two y, or y equals to tan by two, which is five. Now you take this five, put this in this equation. So x equals to fourteen minus five. So x equals to nine. So x equals to nine and y equals to five is the solution of this equation. You can check also. Nine plus five is your fourteen. And nine minus five is your four. So the basic uh, concept of substitution method is take either value of x. You would have taken value of uh, y also. So y equals to fourteen minus x. If you put this in second equation, so x minus in place of y, put fourteen minus x equals to four. So x minus fourteen plus x equals to four. 2x equals to 4 plus 14. 2x equals to 18. X equals to 9. Now y equals to 14 minus x, which is 14 minus 9, which is 5. Okay. And also you can take the value of uh, x or y from second equation also. Let's suppose uh, you take uh, uh, from second equation you take value of x as 4 plus y. Now put this in first equation. So if you put this in first equation, four plus y plus y equals to fourteen. Four plus two y equals to fourteen. Two y equals to fourteen minus four, which is ten. Y equals to five. So any method you choose, the basic concept remains the same. Take the value of x or y from one equation, put that in second equation. You will get the value of x or y. Then find the other value. to get your final answer